A society with no violence, no crime. Sounds perfect, right? But what if it meant no emotions, no love? That's what Kristen Stewart and Nicholas Holt are dealing with in their much-hyped new sci-fi thriller, Equals. First of all, I just want to tell you how much I love your smile. Oh, boy, thank you. You know, I hear that all the time. <laughs> it is absolutely beautiful. You know, I want to know, because I haven't had a chance to see this film yet, but it sounds very raw. Do you find this is a very vulnerable position for you guys to be in this film? That was the goal. Yeah, I mean, the only way to have done this right and not, uh, you know, considering how simple the story is, it's, it's awakening for the first time. It's like, you know, you encounter that throughout a life several times, but this is just every first balled up into one. And the ebb and flow of a relationship that, you know, isn't always perfect. And uh, we both have, like, you know, we both have a lot to give. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, so the only way to do that would have been to feel completely safe and honest and curious and like explorative. And so we just honestly gave it everything that we had. And you did an exercise where you said hello to each other for an hour and really got to know each other. Did that really work? Uh, yeah, it's surprising how much you can tell, uh, not by what someone says, but the kind of little pieces of body language and, and, and other things. You kind of, it's strange, uh, have you ever stared in someone's eyes for that long? It's amazing how much you seem to... Well, we haven't got. <laughs> it's amazing how much you can pick up on and how connected you feel. And then, and Drake creates a wonderful environment um, for you to be vulnerable and, and feel safe to kind of just feel things. One of the games we had to do was like say the opposite of what you were thinking or feeling. I couldn't do it. At no, all. You, he's incapable of lying. It was really interesting. It was so telling. It was like an hour of hello, an hour of utter honesty, and then an hour of you can speak as long as it's a complete lie. And he couldn't play the game. He kept messing it up. I was like, I can tell you're being honest now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah.